gorgeous day in Kansas City. And after I thought I was done with this place here in Florida. Absolutely cursed. Dylan Moore from the Mariners hits a fly ball to left. Moore ran away. He's out. <laughs> Moore thought he was out. Batter thinks the outfielder caught the ball, touches the base, turns around heading to the dugout, then realizes it's not a catch and tries to come back, but you'll notice that even before the fielder tags, first base umpire John Lipka is signaling an out. Why is that? Let's first hear one theory from the broadcast team. And he was out before the throw. First base umpire John Lipka called him technically out of the baseline. <sighs> Batter runner touches first, runs away, comes back. Ruled out not for being out of the baseline, but for abandonment. Specifically, rule 509B2. After touching first base, they leave the base path, obviously abandoning their effort to touch the next base. And the ruling on this is to declare the runner out after they progress a reasonable distance, indicating by their actions they are out. So is this a reasonable distance? It's a combination of technically correct mixed in with umpire judgment regarding what distance is reasonable for an abandonment call. In your opinion, is this a reasonable distance to call a runner out for abandonment or not? He had his head down. He thought he was out. So he hits the base, not being aware of what's going on, and he just lost himself a single. This play might remind you of the Gene Segura running the bases in reverse order. And there is another rule here, but do not get it confused. Rule 509B10 puts the runner out if they do it reverse running for the purpose of confusing the defense or making a travesty of the game. That is not this play because the runner was confused. I think Segura was confused, as was Moore here. So because there's no intent to commit that violation, that call dead ball out does not apply. Instead, as stated, it's the other rule specifically about first base. And the only question is, do you agree that this was a reasonable a distance away from the base to call the out? I say no simply because I like chaos and I wanted to see it play out a little bit more, even though I think the fielder was just going to tag him anyway. So in this series, it's five big outs on the bases. Thanks for the question. Visit us online, closecallsports.com. We're on Discord too, and we'll see you on the site.